What is good, everybody? So, apparently, the mid-season patch is this week. I mentioned that in the last video around the end. I was like, oh, I don't know when the patch, you know, the mid-season patch is gonna come out. Yeah, today, later today. And because of the patch, some of my plans were foiled. I gotta change things up a bit because when the patch was first, you know, released, I was making my big sweep video. I was like, hey, I'm gonna do my vertical tag, toss my wall vertical tag. But now that it got a new buff, big swig, does more horizontal damage. But now I just want to make a new video for Big Swig and delete the old one. But my Splat Torture video should be, you know, good still for tomorrow, the second kit. And I was pretty lucky right there. Oh my god, I missed the first attack. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm recording this after the patch was dropped. And, you know, the original audio or the original gameplay. It was before the patch. They didn't know anything about that. But I decided to scrap that audio and just, just talk about the patch just a little bit. Just some key takeaways I, you know, took from it. And one of the biggest key takeaways is that Brella's got fixed. It should actually pop up the shield faster and other players scream. So now, you know, you don't get shot before you pull up your shield anymore. You won't die from dumb things. And I really hope the Brella shield buff is actually really good or like this fix fixes up everything because I want Brella to be a complete counter to a bunch of shooter class. I want it to be very annoying towards Squeezer, Splash Schematic, stuff like that, like how it used to be in Splatoon 2. But I guess it won't be the exact same because Brella's used to do more damage back in Splatoon 2, the OG Brella. But in general, I like this buff. I hope it actually makes the weapon, you know, I want to see it more often, other Brellas instead of just Tent. I want this weapon class to be good. That's the only thing I'm asking for, please. I, there's like a lot of Brella players who want to use their weapon. Now, the next big thing for me is a Dynamo buff. Actually, I'm actually really happy for all the roller buffs in this one. Carbon should have an easier time killing people up close. And also the Big Swig buff I already mentioned earlier. But Dynamo, Dynamo, bro. Is this is one of the things we've been complaining about, about Dynamo for the longest time. And there's like gaps and it's super annoying because sometimes you know, people can dodge the Dynamo's attack due to the gap. And also there's like, you know, that causes a lot of pain issues. But yeah, the reduced amount of gaps this weapon does now. And that should be very helpful. And why this took so long? We've been complaining about this for a very long time. Just took to this patch. 8.1. Let's go. Uh, yeah. Um, that should make things more easier to kill. And also slightly better to paint. So, yeah. I love that change. And also, they actually increased the hitboxes for the, you know, the flex for ink brushes and also octobrush. But no paintbrush. Screw my weapon, I guess. Nah, that's probably because that already has a giant hitbox. Why do you need to increase it more? And, and there are good changes that Dazzle Dooley, like ink consumption, they reduce it by a lot. So you don't have to, you know, equip that much main saver or sub saver, depending on what you want to equip. You can run less, or maybe people are still going to run a last ditch effort. But yeah, those are the biggest takeaway changes for me. The only things I remember. And yeah, that's everything I want to say. See you at the outro.
Okay, and that does it for today's video. Dread Ringer, love it, love it so much. Really good in zones. The weapon paints a lot. I love my special reliable, and that also paints a lot. Although that is gonna get a nerf, so huh? I mean, it should combat off easier because the explosion range should be good. I mean, but we'll see. We'll see after the patch. But yeah, thank you for watching the video all the way. It means a lot to me. Really appreciate it. You can check out my other content down the channel, which recommended very soon. This is goodbye. Bye.